someone outside of your race? What if your friend or relative was dating someone outside of their race? Would you approve or be dead set against it? Meet Marlene and her daughter, Laura. Laura's boyfriend, Franklin, is black, and Marlene does not approve of their relationship. She says Franklin is not welcome in her home. But Laura says her mom has to either accept their relationship or get out of her life. Franklin's waiting backstage, and we'll hear from him in just a moment, but Laura, I'm gonna start with you. What's going on here? <laughs> you name it. Um, I don't know, it's just I'm not allowed home for holidays. You know, I got two kids, I'm just tired. You know, I'm tired of being pull between her and, and Franklin. And, and it's time for her to know that Franklin and I are living together now. You know, we've, we've committed. And uh, we've- How long have you and Franklin been together? We've been living together now for three months. And uh, we've known each other and dated off and on for a little over a year now. And she's just got to, I don't know, she's got to understand that this is the man I choose to be with, hopefully for the rest of my life. And I have two small kids, and my kids have to come home with the racial remarks, which makes it hard. Wait, your children, when they visit your, your, their, their grandmothers, they come home saying racial remarks? Oh, yeah. Like what? What do they come home saying? Oh, yeah. Um, <laughs> what, which <laughs> your mother with this week? Marlene, is but this you true? You have to tell them where it comes from. It doesn't come from me. It comes from their grandfather. Well, let me ask you, Marlene. You don't like this guy, Franklin, but have you ever met him? I don't know the man. <laughs> Never has she met him. So if, he, if, if Franklin were white, would you, have, would you have no problem with him whatsoever? As long as he treated her and the kids right, no problem whatsoever. Psst. So what, what, why does it make a difference now that he's black? Because I, I was, wasn't raised that way, and I don't believe that way. But what are no, your objections? No, I'm not prejudiced. If he's, how does that make you not prejudiced? I mean, I can sit in a room with black people and talk all day long. But uh, <laughs> as far as uh, sleeping with one, no, I won't. But your daughter chooses to. She happens to be in love with this man. Three months, how does she know she's in love with him? Oh, my God. <laughs> now, right. did you have any idea that they were living together up until you just found no. out a few months ago? What do you think about that? She didn't have any idea we were living together until today. I mean, this is serious. Your, your daughter is not allowed in your home, but yet her children are allowed in your she home. She can come to my home. As long as my boyfriend doesn't come. Hey, you know, I think it's time we meet Franklin. Are you ready to meet Franklin for the first time, Marlene? Franklin, come on out here. Franklin, thank you for, for joining us today. Marlene, you've never met the man before. No. Do you have anything that you want to say to him? No, I don't. <clears throat> Franklin, do you have anything you want to say? Yeah, that she's going to have to face the fact and has to realize that I'm going to be with her daughter for the rest of her life and one day that we're going to marry. And if she don't like it, tell her.